self-assembled monolayers or shafts. What are they? Hi, I'm Rodrigo, PhD student at the University of San Andreas, Scotland. And today, in less than two minutes, I will explain to you what are shafts. Shafts have a thickness of one nanometer, and they are capable of completely changing the surface properties of a material. They have several applications, and they have been used for things as different as controlling the doping on semiconductors, passivation of corrosion and oxidation processes on metals, immobilization of enzymes on surfaces, and detection of metal ions in solutions. There are several ways to prepare a sample, but let me show you how we do it in our group. We start by cutting a small piece of coal. The gold has a thickness of 300 nanometers and it's supported on mica. After that, it's flame annealed 15 to 20 seconds. Then, it's immediately immersed into our chemistry cell where we check the quality of the substrate with a cyclic voltammogram. And if all looks good and under potential deposition, it's performed. This creates a two atom thick layer of silver on top of the gold. Finally, the substrate is immersed into a solution containing our molecules, where, through the magic of enthalpy and entropy, the molecules self-assemble, forming a sum. To study suns, we use different techniques, like scanning tunnel in microscopy, infrared reflection absorption spectroscopy, and X-ray photoelectron spectroscopy, among many others. Sounds spontaneously form when a surfactant adsorbs on the surface. The molecules create an ordered film and have an upright orientation. Sounds are molecular layers with a thickness of one molecule. I hope you liked this video and you learned something new. And remember, material science and engineering made it possible.